because I know that it is controversial and I know that it flies in the face of absolutely everything that the spirit of competition <laughs> was born to create. And you just said, Herman Edwards, you play to win the game. The Lakers should not play tomorrow night. They should not play LeBron. They should not play AD. They do not want to be the seven seed. You want to be the eight. I'm taking my chances in a one and done at home against either Sacramento or Golden State and go in against the very young OKC Thunder in round one instead of going into the buzzsaw that is Denver. I think you, it is worth the risk. Everything you said is right except for one thing. You put yourself into a one-off situation. Okay, where you lose one game, you're going home for the summer if you lose that second night, right? This is different with the Knicks. You're talking about win or lose to, uh, determines your seeding. Right. You still have a best of seven series you're about to go play, right? And event, the better team will win that series. This is different. Like You lose that game intentionally. You put yourself into a situation where you're playing the winner of the 9-10 and anything could happen. If somebody gets hurt. Somebody gets in foul trouble. Somebody just, D'Angelo Russell goes one for 14. Like there's all, so many things could happen in one game. Yes. And you find yourself going home for the summer. I recognize. So I think that's a little bit more precarious. I recognize the risk. But I think life is about assessing risk mm. reward. Is it worth that risk to avoid playing Denver in round one or two? There's no one who can look the, the Nuggets are the one team. The Lakers have no chance to beat. realistically no chance to beat. And you know who knows that LeBron James knows that they got swept by the Nuggets last year. That is a matchup. They are hoping someone else knocks off Denver along the way to me. Alan, it, I understand the risk. And if you wind up losing at home Friday night to Sacramento or Golden State, you wind up looking terrible. But I think it is a risk worth taking. Right, okay, friend. si Thunder, mga kaboltok. O kaya naman, Denver Nuggets. Sino kaya ang number one at ang number two? Sino nga ba ang magandang kalaban ng Lakers sa playoffs? Ang OKC ang number one. Pero mga bagito, 23 anyos ang mga average nila. Samantalang ang champion dati na Denver ay hindi na wala ang core nila noon. Nariyan pa rin ang Big Five. Pero sino nga ba dapat ang makaharap ng Lakers? May dalawang senaryo kasi dyan mga idol. Sinasabing mas may chance ang Lakers kung OKC ang dadaanan nila. Pero daraan naman sila sa butas ng karayom. Dahil hindi na sila dapat matalo sa Golden State Warriors or Sacramento. Pero kung makakatapat naman nila ang Denver, marami ang naniniwalang magandang laban nito. At yun ang gusto ni Lebron James Ang patunayan na hindi nakasyamba sa kanila ang Denver last season At dahil dyan sinilip natin ang kinalalagyan ng Lakers Ano ba ang posibleng mangyari? At hindi nga natin inaasahan na sa play-in tournament na naman natin Makikitang maglalaro muna ang Lakers At lalabanan naman ang New Orleans Pelicans At dahil diyan sinilip natin ang posibleng mangyari mga kaboltok sa first round ng play-in tournament kailangan manalo ng Lakers sa New Orleans Pelicans at pag nangyari yon pasok na sila automatic sa number 7 spot sa playoffs pero kung totoo nga ang balita mga kaboltok na binabalak daw na puntiryahin ng Lakers ang Oklahoma City Thunder sa number 1 spot Kailangan magpatalo ng Lakers sa Pelicans. Nang sa gayon, maglalaro ulit ang Lakers sa second round ng play-in tournament kung saan lalabanan naman nila ang mananalo sa Sacramento at ang number 10 na GSW. Paglalabanan nila diyan ang number 8 spot sa playoffs. Ngayon mga kaboltok, must win game na yan. Win or go home, ika nga. Kailangan manalo ng Lakers kung sino ang mananalo sa Kings or Warriors upang ang Lakers ay opisyal nang mapunta sa number 8 spot nang sa gayon makakalaban naman nila ang number 2 na OKC sa first round ng playoffs dahil kung mapupunta ang Lakers sa number 7 spot lalabanan nila sa first round ang Denver Nuggets na number 2 Ngayon mga kaboltok, maraming naniniwala na may hirapan daw ang Lakers sa Denver dahil nga sa nakita nila last season, Denver versus Lakers sa Western Conference Finals at hindi nanalo ang Lakers dyan sa 4 games na yan. Pero kung iiwasan talaga nila ang Denver, may chance daw ang Lakers na manalo naman sa OKC na number 1. 
Marami nga ang naniniwalang maging ang kritiko diyan na may tulog daw ang OKC sa Lakers kung magaharap sila sa playoffs. Ngayon mga kaboltok ang tanong, maniniwala ka rin ba na kayang talonin ng Lakers ang OKC maging ang Denver Nuggets? Abangan natin yan kaya tumutok ka lamang at magsubscribe na. Yon mga idol, anong masasabi mo sa video natin for today? Mag-comment ka na lamang sa ibaba at huwag mo kalilimutang mag-subscribe kung bago ka pa lamang. Bisitahin mo din ang ating Facebook page. Bas